They'll be calling you a radical. I want to talk about this. I got to get as much into the library as possible. You know, look, Dane is up on the water. His classroom was so powerful. He did so much fantastic work. Jan, Miss Milk of the Clown's gone. You know, Missing Sky has gone. You know, this long, I mean, the, the counter, this is so important. This work gets done. You know, not just as the activist, as the professor's librarian, I, I had a fall. I have implants. I just came from there. God, if it isn't one thing, it's another with me. So as my walk along the coast, I used to use public libraries, all this. So let's talk about this. You know, the whole country's like, oh, this could happen. This pretty poor balance could happen. The ecological catastrophe could happen. This could happen. It already happened. It happened. You're worried about fucking Supreme Court now? Where were you in 2000 Bush for? Where were you on freaking preparations are people? Where are you on gerrymandering? The gerrymandering district. Decade. The decade of the gerrymander. Fucking red flag fuckhead. Well, just remember one thing. Remember one thing. Under the Obama reign, that in blackface only, him and the betrayer, the great betrayer, Uncle Tommy Obama, who, who you betrayed you? He betrayed you. He's the great corporatist fucking oligarchist fucking right wing fucking in history. Just like Kennedy. The Supreme Court's going to flip the Supreme Court. Where were you? Fucking mission accomplished. The great catastrophe. This is the smoking gun. These are the Chinook salmon. Oh, you don't think this is a collapse? It's almost over. That's the number. What? What? For the year. Oh, yeah. That's... Whoa. What? 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 One. Oh, you don't think this is a catastrophe? You know fucking nothing. Tide pools are all fucking dead. Oh, they come back, come by, y'all. Fucking print media puts it all these, as I call it, the black and yellow media whores. And you just read the headline and go along. Yay, come by fucking y'all. You know, oh, the Supreme Court's going to flip the Supreme Court out of it. You could put Satan himself on there because who can he? The great betrayer. The great betrayer. Remember, he, Obama was supposed to be the champion of people of color, the champion of the underprivileged, the champion of the ecology, the champion of the progressive, the champion of the working class, the anti-war guy. Remember the anti-war resistance? Remember the anti-war movement? That's how this all started at a peace rally with Code Pink. I got brass knuckles across the face by a cop. For holding up a sign that says Bush lied, fucking soldiers died right here in Utah. That was in way back. Whoa, how am I alive? And I thought that was the worst. I'd been through the worst. I was in emergency critical condition. You went to yell for, jail for a year for trying to murder me. For what? 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 You know, I had my dad's dog tags on then at the time. If I wouldn't have my dad's dog tags, I'd been dead. Because some other Marines saw that and that knew my dad. The cop that got called onto it, this cop was fucking all in my face, whatever, you know. But the other cop saw the dog tags and he says, Oh, you're Dwayne's son. Yeah. He hugged me and started to cry. I fell and broke one of the teeth out after the rest. <sighs> Comes full circle, don't it? Kennedy. Oh, yeah, he's your swing vote. Yeah, you're right, he was the swing vote. He voted for every corporatist oligarch whoredom fucking piece of shit. This fucking right wing has two, this bird has two fucked up right wings and a crash. The, who's to blame? Trump? Oh, fuck no. We know what Trump is. He told you right to your fucking face. What is, remember this. Obama lost 12, 12, 12 cents. So it's not gerrymandering. I mean, gerrymandering, what a fucking illegal crap. Fucking Arnold, Arnold. <laughs> oh, fuck, another one. Go to Austria. They don't claim him. So... They claim freedom Eisenhower. <laughs> they don't claim that scumbag Hitler either. I mean, they resist. They tell you, we took a lot of blood to get to where we are at. They're fantastic. They recycle everything. Oh, they get it there. Not here. They're protectionist. Tariffs? <laughs> they ain't about to let our fucking dairy fucking in. They're not about to let our... And I've been to Bot House, by the way. They're in Eugene, Oregon. The only thing authentic. They're good. I drank a lot of beet juice and a carrot juice. I'll give them a call out. I was given two months to live. I was too sick for a bone marrow transplant center. I'm the only one. I'm the only one. I, I mean, my case has been written up all over. My case is famous. Now a lot of my stuff's coming out that they classified. I, I got an email yesterday. Look at this. Ha! Huh. Some of the stuff when I went back from Santa Barbara just got released yesterday, and I did that in 2013 going at them. We're going to hit the beach here, beach. They classified me. 
Nothing to see, huh? Good happen. Gonna happen. The swing bow. Just remember, Bush Gore. Bush Gore. Kennedy. <laughs> uh, William Tribe himself. I'm buyers. Everybody says the greatest fucking spit in the face to the United States Constitution in fucking history. The Supreme Court had no right. They had no fucking rules. That's not a court. That's court. What was it? I think it was Jackson said. You can fucking put, I'll, I'll pack fucking 15 of them on there. Fuck, Supreme Court's a joke. It's a political fucking apparatus. Now, just remember, did they jerry-rig the Senate seats? Nope. Obama lost 12. 12. Remember the supermajority? Fuck, because of the peace activists and the fucking big resistance, the anti-Bush, fuck, it was massive. Supermajority, 60-40. What'd they do with it? What'd they do with it? They Hillary Clinton, same as 1994, threw down a fucking corporate fucking Obama fucking care right in the fucking face and tried to kick it down the American populace's fucking throat. Instead of fucking trickling and doing the things that we fought, we elected them, we elected them to put Cheney and Bush in fucking prison to go after the war criminals, to fucking downsize the military, to get out of Afghanistan, to get Iraq. We're still there. I went off to Afghanistan to kill the Taliban. What? What? We're still there? How many years later? Went off to Iraq to get a big old sack for Dick Cheney. What? 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 We're still there? White phosphorus on your own fucking man. Just like my father, San Onofre. Fucking went off to Vietnam to kill the Viet Cong. Fucking, <laughs> fucking. How nice is we invented fucking ISIS? Fucking, oh, fucking, Obama gave him Cromaria. <laughs> no, that scumbag Putin took it. Putin fucking, I mean, the warmonger. Fucking, so Trump will hang with Putin. He'll hang with fucking the North Korea fucking murder your own fucking uncle, your own fucking father. But fuck Trudeau in Canada. Fuck Merkel in fucking Germany. Fuck him. At, what? What? They're our friends. They're our fucking friends. Get rid of fucking NATO. Oh, yeah, so we can have the same fucking Bavarian Nazis back. Fuck, are you going to fucking ro all the the royal family, it's back. Who do you think Trump is? Look at his wife. Where do you think her bloodlines are? <laughs> Jared, boy, what do you think? I mean, it's the same old thing. 1916, we fought two world wars. It didn't do any good. But who's to blame? In blackface only. Tommy Obama. How about Kennedy? Kennedy. The worst Supreme Court justice in it. Why? Because they claim to be the of the people. Of the people. Of the underprivileged. Of, I mean, you saw the inauguration. Massive. Did he betray everybody, Obama? He vetoed the 9-11. He could have pocket vetoed the fucking Patriot Act. He didn't. Patriot Act. Constitution. Gone. Mission. Accomplished. Illegal Act. Everything the Supreme Court's done is illegally because Bush did not win. Bush Gore. Bush Gore. Bush. That's all you have to say. Bush Gore. That was the most illegal act. Everything else has been downhill ever fucking since. Gerrymand districts. Oh, yeah. That's disgusting. Carl Rove. Right here. Right here. Right here. On this university. We were state. We ran that motherfucker out of town. So he set up shop in Texas. Carl's not from here. I will quote Carl with a small C, as his ex-wife says. Well, you know, he has a real small penis. That's why he does what he does. But you let him because you had Obama and Kennedy who lied. The great betrayers. Kissinger's bitch on a leash. Obama. The cover-up of Fukushima. The greatest crime. And I want to say this because I've been very depressed the last few days. I was young. Well, my body was incredible. When I got cancer, right here. I got cancer right here. ML leukemia. Given a death sentence, given two months to live. My body went through so much hell. As you know, I had open heart surgery last year. I had emergency ruptured gallbladder surgery two months ago. I got through it all physical strong, physical strong, but I went from being young to old in this Obama era, in this seven, the Fukushima cover up era. It aged the fuck out of me. I was young. I'm not young anymore. I'm old. Wisdom beyond my years? Oh, boy. My body? Uh, you only see the scars up and down my body now. I have four tattoos up me now from the radiation. I have the Fukushima fish hook, central line going to my jugular. I have my chest split open, open heart surgery scar. I have four scars down here from, of course, the brass knuckles. I used to have a Roman nose, believe it or not. Well changed everything on me. To be an activist? Whoa. Now you know why. Remember Obama fucking uh, Heyman and Ortiz, the Obama administration, took out Anonymous. Killed more whistleblowers, took out more whistles, put Megan Rice in a prison cell for life. Dorothy Day's protege, the greatest peace activist of our time, Megan Rice, put her in a prison cell. Fucking melt the hold for three fucking weeks. The only media there, Kevin Blanche, full of leukemia, Knoxville, Tennessee. 85-year-old peace activist, the greatest peace activist in the country, a famous New Yorker. 19th page of the New York Times, just like fucking the commission. 
when they went in and did the recount. Huh. How fuck? When was it due out? September 2011. We went from 311 to 911 to 311. Whoa. Wow. 911 to 311. I went from young to old. Whoa. What a fight. What a journey. Walking the coast of California in a spiritual fucking thing. Everybody thought I would die. Everybody, including doctors. And, you know, I had faith. Could happen. Gonna happen. I mean, you think about the attacks I've been under. My emails attacked, me classified by own, my own government. By my own government. As I stood in front of the White House, when I been at the Million Mass March. Did you ever think it'd be so difficult to tell the fucking truth? To tell the truth is go to jail. To fucking lies to be an oligarch fucking god. We are not sheep. We are not fucking sheep. They asked me, they asked me that the... Well, you had millions that occupied. We're not Occupy. You know? And Occupy was powerful. Occupy was the baby. It gave birth, as I said. It gave birth, and the child learned to walk. And then the child got fucking in debt going to college. Well, that child's young, and it's brown, and it's female, and they're in the fucking street, because I'm there with them. That baby's fucking grown up. That baby's not a child anymore. That baby's very fucking real. Wait till you see this November, remember, remember. We don't forgive, we don't forget. Gonna happen, could happen. Happened. Happen. Happen. Mission accomplished. Chinook Sam go to sea for five years. The smoking gun of Fukushima. <laughs> you seen the fucking debt? You seen the fucking debt? We poisoned the earth. We fucking mission accomplished. Game over? Or did you sleep last night? Don't you lie to me. If I thought it was completely over, I'd be dead, wouldn't I? Few people believe me. The type of survival I have in cancer in my body is way less than 1%. It's on survival disease. Without a bone marrow, it's impossible. Huh. That was almost seven years ago. My body's worn out. My body fucking bruised. My hands are fucking tied. Fucking in the prison. Huh. With or fucking without you. It's all I can do to keep waiting for you. You know. What a fight. Alitos. Roberts. <laughs> Carl Rose baby. Fucking Obama. They didn't jerry rig the Senate. He lost 12 Senate seats. The Democrats all know. Everybody that knows. And I think that he lied. He betrayed. Hillary Clinton lied. Betrayed. All of them. The fucking left captured. They knew it. Huh, everything they fought for, the anti-war movement, fuck. He was the biggest warmonger there ever was. He said that, they said he used to like sit down and fucking watch the fucking droney. The sick fucker. His mother Stanley rolling over in her grave. Yeah, his mother's real name Stanley from Kansas. Died of cancer at Downwinder. He don't give a fuck. Sick fucker. Kennedy, worst Supreme Court justice in history. Obama in blackface only. Fucking what a lying dirtbag. We don't get fooled again. Oh, you got fooled again. <laughs> Trump fooled you again. Stay in tune it. They go to sea for five years. Kevin Wise is the only one that predicted it. 2016, they'll collapse. Record escapement, record escapement. Rec Talk to a guy from Alaska at the march from here. Big guy. And I says, well, you're fishing. Yeah, yeah. He says, well, what about... You think it's, you know, I talked to him about Fukushima. He says, everybody up there knows it's Fukushima. We know. He says, I could tell. I should have got a video with him. He went on a rant and says, you should have seen it before Fukushima. He says, fuck, you can walk over and whatever. Post, they're gone. It's over. He says, everybody in Alaska knows it's Fukushima. Not in Oregon. Fucking not in fucking Washington. Not in Fairytale, Cal Car, California. Fucking, you're on the winning team. Come fishing. Come fishing. Fucking, Alaska just filed out, filed for an emergency bailout. Today, today, they fucking filed the state to declare it a fucking emergency. They declare this emergency. But it's all good. You, you did not lie me, the Great Pacific Genocide, predicted it all to a T. They're going to dump it in the Pacific Ocean. They're going to lie. It's going to genocide the Pacific Ocean. Fucking big fish. It's the ecology, stupid. Cancer for all. Thank you, Barry Antoinette Obama. I told you what happened in the Situation Room. Word for word. I read Hillary's emails online. Word for word. I took so much fucking risk. All Fukushima cover-up. I told you Holden did it, right up. You didn't want to believe me. Well, they declassified a bunch of my stuff yesterday. It's starting to come out. Stand tuned.